Millie Ma, Millie Ma, Millie Ma. It won't be times two today. <laughs> Excuse me. It was late in the day for me to be getting out the house. Excuse me. Just down some water. It was late in the day for me to be getting out the house. It's just not 3 o'clock. We got an appointment for 3.30, uh, time frame for a, I think it's a pickup and delivery of like an armoire. Buddy that y'all seen on my channel not too long ago, KT business called moving with love he uh he hit me up he hit me up for today's job and tomorrow's gig so, getting to this paper best we can yippee, yippee. thanks for being part of the journey y'all another day getting to another dollar baby please hit that like button if you're new to the channel go ahead and scroll through the channel Check out some of the old videos, some of the new videos that kind of give you a, a feel of what this channel is about. It's nothing in particular, but except for my daily hustle, that's the only thing that's pretty much inconsistent uh, in these videos. Is I'm hustling daily, working on my goals. A big goal that I have right now is to get my first carrier, my first truck driver, to start dispatching him to find him our freight and dispatch him around the country. I need me a few of them because what's that gonna do is allow me to be able to get out here and uh, earn money from anywhere. You know what I mean? If I decide to get up and move up out of state or have to move out of state for whatever reason, I can still have a way to earn some cheese. Cause everything else I do, even what my old lady does, she's a she's a, a hairdresser. Um, she does hair. I do massage therapy. I teach people. I do jumping moves. You know what I mean? So maybe I could potentially go to another city and not potentially. I for sure could go to another city and start doing some junk removal type stuff. But that's a hustle. I'm trying to get out of the hustle type of work into something more scalable I'm trying to build a business that's more scalable and i believe this trucking industry is the way to do it it's good cheese and it's consistent so that's my thought process on it at least um, yeah that's just what it is right now who knows should be changing i'll go with the flow of things but i do know financial stability and not stability but uh Trying to get ahead financially, not be living day to day, check to check, however you want to it. So that's it, that's all. I'm concentrating on this road. I'll holler at y'all when I get up there on location. Peace. Oh, these motherfuckers can't drive, bro. Looking in the mirror, man, I notice I had a little booger in my nose. And I get closer, and I'm looking, I'm like, that ain't no booger. <laughs> that ain't no goddamn booger. That's a gray hair in my nose. Well, that's how you know I'm getting old. Oh, wait. I got some hair coming out my ears around this motherfucking shit. I ain't got no ear, hair coming out my ears yet, so... I ain't getting that old yet. <laughs> I got a goddamn gray head in my nose. Ain't that about it, bitch. Ooh, wee. Anyway, I got here a little bit early, man, so just parlay. Yeah, I think so. We probably could, yeah. 
So I'm, uh, I want to pull it out so we can get these blankets on it. Let's put these rubber bands on it. So like I was saying before, I was really interrupted by my camera battery dying. Can I finish? Okay, quiet real quick. She said she measured the, excuse me, she measured the armoire and said that it'll fit in her crib as long as the legs wasn't on it. So we're like, okay, cool. We end up knocking the legs off. Actually, her neighbor did. Knock the legs off to, to discover that it's bolts in there like this long. So we like, uh, what you wanna do? We can move it into the crib. Uh, that's our job to move it from point A to point B. We at point B. And we don't know about all this taking stuff apart and all that. We can help as much as possible. But so, buddy, as we talking to her about this, buddy goes and grabs the tools. He comes back with a sledgehammer, sledgehammer the legs off. Um, we get it in the crib. We looking at each other like this thing ain't gonna fit, bro. What? No, don't play with that. Yeah. You know how it is when you get like, how can I put it? Armoire in this in your house. We got it. We got it laying sideways, not standing up. For it to stand up, obviously we got to do like this, right? Ain't no way we gonna be able to. Not we, they. Yeah. Ain't no way they're gonna be able to do this because it's gonna hit the ceiling. It would have had to come in like this or come in in a certain certain type of way and it's too big to clear the doorway so i don't know she may have to take that bad boy back or sell it or something but now she gotta sell it without the legs on it not too big of a deal i don't think because that bad boy is big so either way um back at the crib man back in these study materials i'm glad i didn't start uh calling around to you know new carriers so I'm, I'm still not confident yet start going back over these training materials and um i still didn't have everything lined up like i wanted to i'm pretty sure i do now but as of like yesterday and uh the day before that is when i said it i think i said i was going to start the next day i wasn't ready i should be ready pretty soon now as of right now y'all that's it g that's it that's all I'm gonna get in these in the study material and come up with my plan of action. Um, get on these load boards. That's what I really need to do. Navigate these load boards. Get more comfortable with the load boards. And then it's a go. It's been part of the journey, y'all. If any of y'all are truck drivers or know some truck drivers thinking about going that route into truck driving, keep me in mind, man, for your dispatching services pass this along to people uh, uh i'll come up with a flyer or something put it in these videos too that way y'all y'all can see it and all my contact information will be on there you can forward it to people or whatever 
So yeah, I'll be sure to do that. Um, that's it for now, y'all. I ain't got no more work lined up. So I'll holler later. Had another job. I had two jobs. I had one for later on tomorrow. No, I had two jobs tomorrow. I had one job for today. Two jobs tomorrow. The, the earlier job is still a go. The later job just canceled. So 